What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Critical Old Lord here. Since I'm talking about Scream 6 in this video here again today. Talking about Nev Campbell, Sydney Prescott, and her being back in the movie. Now, this is something that I've been told by someone that I trust very much. This is someone who has never had any misses with me so far as far as like when they relay information to me. This is also someone who would come to me tell me things about screen five it was to the point where i kind of blurred some of the stuff they were saying because i want to go into the movie as ignorant as i could um and then of course a lot of the stuff that was told to me ended up being true and i know there was that one time during when screen five was filming this i think was around after judy hicks got announced that i put out a post showing people that certain things had been told to me before screen five had come out now with nev and her involvement i'm being told that she has indeed managed to ink a deal i guess and she'll be back in the movie as sydney prescott now i do just want to say of course it's not official till it comes from paramount because of course i'm not involved directly with production or anything like that but this individual who told me this again their track record and who i know they're in contact with They've never had any misses with me. They're telling me that Sidney Prescott will be back. They're telling me Nev Campbell has signed on. I believe them. We'll all see if it's ultimately going to be the case when we sit down and see the movie in March of 2023. And I know that there are already people who are on the side of saying that they've been told that she's actually not in it by other people that they trust as well. So honestly, you know, if anything, this is a very easy way clever way to get people to go out and see your movie still because now you have that uncertainty about nev campbell being back at sydney prescott is she or isn't she in it because of the fact that we know that the biggest rumor earlier this year was that she was going around saying to people that she wasn't in it then of course she came out and made that official statement other official outlets picked up on it she made a statement about how she felt that she she wasn't being valued by what she was offered and that she wouldn't be returning because of that now all these weeks later there's rumors starting up again and it's like okay well if those first round of rumors were true why aren't these going to end up being true and again i've been told by someone i trust who was sharing details with me about the last screen movie that she signed on i believe she's back i believe she will be in the movie as sydney prescott if she's not in it then she's just not in it and i was wrong and you know that's fine with me so i do want to now talk about her involvement as far as like how heavily involved i think she'll be with her signing on here's the thing they've already shot so much to my knowledge apparently and according to everyone else of course who like me is on twitter following a lot of the stuff going on and seeing that they went ahead and shot a lot of stuff without nev's involvement so with nev inking a deal while production is ongoing that should be a clear sign to a lot of people that she's probably in this on the same level as screen five or possibly slightly even less she i know was saying to people and i know jamie kennedy has a video out where he's talking about how she had a bigger role i put out a tweet just to remind everybody bigger doesn't have to mean longer <laughs> you could have a bigger role in the sense of what your presence does in the grand scheme of things for the time that you're on on set there could be something that happens here in scream six related to sydney prescott that even if her time on screen is much shorter than what we had her for in screen five it's something that hits harder something that strikes a core a lot more something that is a lot more impactful because of what it represents what you could end up having is a scenario in which sydney prescott appears at the end of the movie to set up whatever is to come in scream seven if scream six is a success you could have something like that occur i just don't think that this bigger role that nev herself was talking about and sharing with jamie kennedy who again i believe made a video of uh, talking about it and defending her stance on the whole not returning idea this bigger role that she's talking about i don't believe she went into any specifics with jamie i i, I truly don't 
this bigger role doesn't mean that she was interacting with Mindy here and there, acting, interacting with Kirby here and there, interacting with uh, Gail Weathers, you know, Tara, Sam, all these people. It doesn't mean she was doing that. This bigger role could be bigger from Nev's perspective because of what they're requiring Sydney to accomplish in the short time that she's in the movie. That's just le legitimately what it could be. Someone could tell me something about what they want me to do in a movie. And I could think it's the biggest thing ever. Doesn't mean I have a lot of screen time. It's just the simple fact that you want me to do what? You want me to do this to, to accomplish this? That's a pretty big role and I want you to pay me accordingly. You know, it's just something as simple as that. <laughs> Doesn't mean she had all these scenes with these other characters that are in the movie. I truly don't think she's gonna have any scenes with anyone in this movie outside of just herself maybe. Um, and again, something happening at the end of the movie. Only because going off the fact that they, they went ahead and kept filming this movie without her returning, which kind of, again, is a sign to me that she didn't have that big of a role, if not probably less of a role than she does in five. But knowing that she's back, that's nice to know. And again, coming out of March 2020 or in March of 2023, we'll all see if this ends up being the case, because honestly, what we're in now is a Spider-Man No Way Home scenario. People are still going to go out of their way to see your movie now because of this doubt in their head that Nev Campbell is back or she isn't back. So I know a lot of people saw this originally originating from someone who was reported to be stalking crew members. And that's not who I got this from. I will say that that's not who I got this from. That person, although from my from my memory, they did share like a block sheet of filming information that ended up being true. So it's not that necessarily they're lying as much as it is. I know people don't find them credible because of how insane they seem to be. And I just want to make it clear. That's not who I got this information from. I didn't get it from them. I did not. I do not contact with them. I don't have them on any social media. I have them blocked as as good as I possibly can. I believe this person though, who told me that Nev Campbell will be back as Sydney and Scream 6. We'll see how true it is. Let me know what you guys think about all this down in the comment section below. If you haven't already, of course, make sure you subscribe. Turn on post notifications. You never miss a video. In the description, I have links to my social media accounts on so Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. You can message me there, of course. Let me know any movies, news, or reviews you would like me to cover in the future. And with all that in mind, guys, I will see you in the next video.